I don't want to injure a finger. What's it mean to be bowl eligible? You know, it, it means it means a lot. But you know, as this program is built, we're trying to get bigger and better. So we're looking forward to get more wins. You know, that was that was a great and relief to get over the hump. You know, now last year was getting over the hump. Now this year, you know, keeping keep going up that ladder, keep stacking. You know, get prepared for the next uh, opponent. So you know, so it is. Could you take us through the interception in the uh, second half? The play yeah. Every- um, you know, it's just a matter of everybody doing their job. D line getting the pass rush. We getting lined up, communicated. I made the play, but you didn't see the D line getting the pass rush. The corner stand with his doing his job. You know, it's you know, one player gets the credit, but it, like it's a team effort to get those uh, plays out on the board. As a group of safeties, you've been really bringing the boom. How how have you been doing your run fits and talk about the physicality of the safety play? Um, that all goes back. I'll say that goes back to coaching because that's again a lot where the credit's not given put. Um, they make sure we're always you know reading our keys to help us run past so we can be able to play fast. If you don't read your keys, you're not gonna be able to get to the run. Um, but you know we, have, we have, all our safeties love physicality. As you see, every one of our safeties is gonna come up and hit. That's just a style of play we like. We call ourselves the Reapers. You know, it's this uh, mentality that we like to have. Looking at what you guys did in the first half and then the second half, is that second half performance what you guys kind of see as what this team you, you hope to be and is capable of being, you know, going forward? We don't hope to be a second half team. We want to play four quarters, but, you know, we have been known to come out in the second half after adjustments and just playing. Um, you know, Northwestern had a lot of time to prepare for us, so they threw a lot of multiples out uh, that we didn't see. So at halftime, it was more of uh, the leaders and the coaches getting us all honed in. It's like, you know, do our job. There ain't nothing we're going to change. We're going to go out there and play Maryland football, and that's what we did in the second half. And, uh, you know, now you're on the defense, so during that Roman Hemby 75 yard touchdown on the sidelines, can you kind of tell us what it was like on the sidelines during that run? <laughs> oh, we was all lit, but you got to be, you got to be real. We see that all the time. That kid's very special. Um, that was a big moment to play. We all feed off each other. Like, we, if the offense scores a touchdown, the uh, offense come back and say defense get it back. Same vice versa. So, you know, that's all our brothers. So we loved it. What worked for you guys in the second half is you held them to just a touchdown. The two picks for you guys as a team, you also turned them over on down. I felt like we were uh, asleep the first. I don't. I don't want to say because we came out kind of strong and then we kind of lapsed and got uh, kind of complacent and didn't play our style of play. So we stopped communicating, stopped you know playing our style of play. Like I said, but we came out second half. I made sure I would talk to every single position group. It was like, let's go. We got to turn up. We're gonna play Maryland football. Have some juice. Have some energy. Ran on and off the field. We celebrated together and then we were able to. You know, come out with a dub. Obviously, a lot of injuries on the defensive side for you guys. How'd you guys adjust? Uh, next man up. I mean, locks. There's nothing else need to be said. On um, locks, recruits well. So if somebody goes down, we're able to bring somebody in, like like a Caleb Wheat in, Leland and stuff like that to come in, or a Billy to come in to like not have a drop off like that. So yeah. So from playing lacrosse and being a star midi, how how does that communication thing work in football? Does it help you? Um, I wouldn't say it. I'm just not, I wouldn't say there's a lot of communication lacrosse, but uh, you know, there's a lot of similar things that you carry over. I would just say toughness. That's it. That's about it. When it comes to the the, the rotating faces you guys had on defense today, did did you and Bo sort of feel like an extra sense of of leadership there today on the back end? Of course. Um, most of the calls it starts with us and ends with us. You know, our position is safety, so you're the last line of defense. Mm-hmm. We look at the call, we're giving calls to three and three and four people. So they look at us, even though we might be young and not a lot of experience, they look at us to, to rally the guys. The people that make plays got to, they look up the people that, you know, have voice. And we're going to speak every play. You're going to hear me every play. You're going to hear me when I'm on the sideline. I may say some stuff that make you mad, but at the end, I'm, you, I love you, you're my brother, but that's, that's just a role we have. How does the return of Glendon Miller help the unit? It helped us a lot because um, we slowly just got Jacorian Bennett back at nickel. So, uh, Glenn has been able to play nickel, and it helps you know keep us fresh. So I don't want to play 100 snaps, but if I have to, I have to. Like it's, this game is tough, and we're in the Big Ten, so Glenn is a special player. Part he doesn't get a lot of the limelight, but he's gonna you're gonna see him coming up shortly. Uh, on the pick, were you reading the eyes, or do you actually recognize the play? Um, we've got that. So they ran the same screen action about three times. So on that third one, he gave me a little shopping cart like fake block. I was like, he's going for a pass. So. The, I saw Pete quarterback for a second. I knew it was an angle, so I just drove my man. Thank you, John. That's good. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Appreciate you, John.